So continuing on with the 510 swap, myself and this young man, we're over here trying to figure out this exhaust. And the manager walks up and just like, we go sit in there. Now we know why he gets paid the big bucks. What you got to say for yourself, Jaime? This is my first rodeo. <laughs> <laughs> so let's raise it up and uh, see what it look like. Yeah, it's clearing. Um, yeah, it's rubbing a little bit. We might have to uh, massage, a little. massage a little, but other than that, it's stuck. stuck? Yeah. All right. All right. A little massage in there on, at the idler, or not the idler, but the pit man. Yeah. So it's it's only this right here. Yeah. That's it. It's not really. It's not hitting anywhere else. No. Nah. I mean, it's close as shit right here to the floor. So he's gonna have to do what I did. Put a um. Friggin' hanger to put pressure on this to keep it, and then. Well, we don't know yet because the gap up there, everything's still gonna kick a little pivot so this may actually rotate down a little bit more when this bolt's fully up to the head yeah we're not it's not too much room but we'll see but yeah so we just got to massage here a little bit and oh. it's, uh, while it's in the air i'm gonna go ahead and plug everything up down here yeah listen, listen. well he heard a pop that was the pop Timing belt's gone. Well, all right, ladies and gentlemen. Um, as you can see, wire and harness is in. I did try my best to somewhat tuck it. We're not done here. Pitting this back to the firewall as yet. Um, ground cable is already in the main ground. Let me get some light down there. This is a... Uh, for the mass mass air flow control sensor um and guys wiring specialties uh, it's my first time working with one of their um products and they label every um plug seriously so you cannot go wrong egt um over here we have Ignition coil. All right. If you're familiar with KA, you know how that goes over here. Um, but this is as far as we got. The we didn't really record the process. Um, it took us about uh, two hours getting everything in, getting it in place. So, other than that, this is where we're at so far. Uh, some ISR headers. This is going to give you some problems going in, but it will fit. You just gotta have to dance with it. But other than that, this that's the progress we have so far. Um, I'll leave the interior of the car for a later date to show you guys. But progress. Radiator should be here soon. Once it gets here, we go to install that, get correct hoses plumbed up, and we get ready to uh, pop this thing off. See what happens. I appreciate you guys coming back, viewing the videos. Thank you so much. Um, hope you guys are learning something. Um, this is not a channel where I script things. I try to plan stuff out, but you know how life goes. And it's it's that's just what it is but um hope you guys are learning something as well as being entertained because my co-workers they're comedians but yeah that's what we have we're gonna continue on with this and i hope you guys are enjoying the videos now that the g35 is out 
sometime soon. I'll get back to the 240. All right. Appreciate y'all watching as always.